After more than four years of employment, Tara Pei Fei left her job and chose to follow her passion and started a school in Juba, South Sudan. Juba Parent School officially opened in 2012, May the 16th. I had put everything in place, the chairs for the kids. I was already going to use my own house to start the school. I just ran short of money and I needed to start it that very month. She met a friend who introduced her to Cordaid's local partner, Rufi, who gave her a loan to bridge her capital. So I went to Rufi, I talked to them, and they looked at my potentials, and so they were able to give me 20,000 pounds. I was able to do the advert to get in my teachers, paint the compound, and also I kept getting money from Rufi. That's how I completed the structure. On 15th of December, when the war broke out, we knew that there was going to be a problem. We lost uh, around 80% of the kids. Some of them were camping in the UN Miss compounds, and we kept talking to some of them. Um, some of them returned after a while, but uh, we still couldn't reach the number that we had last year. Access to quality education opens lifetime opportunities. Tarape is working to complete the school beyond high school level and to open other branches. The school opened with enrollment of 15 pupils in the first term. Right now we have 102. By empowering women entrepreneurs like Tarape through access to financial services, women can in turn empower others. We are grateful and I hope there are more ladies out there who would want to do something and they are being held back. They should be sure of what they want to do and, and then they can also start. <laughs>